Okay, where are we? We'll find out in a moment. Well, it's the, the old pine or old oak trail. Oh. But it's a part of the... McKinley Woods? Yeah, McKinley Woods. We got a trail runner. Okay, so we're we're kind of at the bottom of the hike for the furthest most point. There are two loops to do here. We're on one of them. Have we talked about what you brought up to me? Uh, I think it was in the car about what hiking means to us or why being in nature is so valuable to us. No, I don't think we've talked about that much. Do you want to kick off a response on that? Or? Well, I like the quote that you found where a person said, Oh, yeah. You know, nature and being on hikes does, <laughs> does not reflect back your subconscious. Yeah, so there was a TikTok video that I found. And this man, he explains the value of being in nature. And in nature, you don't have your subconscious reflected back to you. In fact, nature is a place that can absorb your subconscious. So, so it's relaxing. It's relaxing, it's like a reset. It's like yeah. all of the subconscious tendencies that you, that you have in your everyday life, you can watch that slowly fade away you let down your barriers and your guard as you hike in nature. Whereas the city or non-nature is always a reflection back. It's a mirror yeah. to your subconscious behaviors. It was very resonant for me. Me too. All right, well now we got it on film. So we can reflect it back. <laughs> Talk about it. The eternal reflection. Mm. <laughs>